Bringing a veterinary college into a region does more than just train veterinarians. It brings research expertise, it brings clinical expertise to the area, and they address problems that are relevant to the area. So, so you get much more than just new veterinarians trained. You get that whole community that comes to the province. The school was formed really because of two pressures. One was a recognition that there were not enough veterinarians serving Alberta, particularly rural Alberta. The second one was uh, BSE, and that really drew attention to the fact that there are a lot of links between animal health and human health and the environment. If you're going to build a new college, you want to do something that's different. You also want to make it a college that's going to fit into the environment and the culture where it's located. And we really wanted the support of the veterinary community behind us. Our BBM program is a little bit different in that we start the students out with their clinical training in the very first year. So very first day, very first year, we start getting them into the labs. And um, we also place a great emphasis on using uh, simulator models and experiential learning experiences. The idea was that they would go out into these practices and institutions and see firsthand the kind of casework that they're going to be doing themselves when they graduate. In my clinical work, I'm out in general veterinary practice. I'm also out at Spruce Meadows during the tournament season, working on all the problems that we see with show horses. And that's what the students need to see. That's what they need to spend their time on. And we work on those cases together, and that's a much more meaningful education for them. The combined responsibility of doing our job as well as teaching those are things that make us better as veterinarians. There's nothing but pride. You know, I'm extremely proud of the school. I'm still involved in the school. And, um, you know, it's, it's been fun actually seeing the recognition of the school grow. Um, you know, from my first year going and visiting practices in the States who had never heard of the school, and now we're starting to get more and more students getting internships and residencies in the U.S. And I think our school has an excellent, excellent reputation, and I see nothing changing. I see a bright future for it. You can do extensive orthopedic surgery on horses and then you can go back and treat, you know, treat your kittens or you can do soft tissue surgery on, you know, anything in the clinic. So there's always lots to do and a lot of it's really exciting. Oftentimes in universities, research happens, you know, from ideas that come from professors. And by working closely with community veterinarians, uh, and animal industries, we're in a position not just to tell them what we've done and hope it's relevant, but actually to listen to them as to what their problems are and to work with them. If you imagine the situation of there being no veterinary faculty here 10 years ago to where we are now, where we've got almost 70 faculty members, multiple research programs in place. When you're looking at the opportunity to do veterinary research, it's one of the best places in the world to be. The very close physical relationship we have with the way our research space is integrated physically and with the Faculty of Medicine's in, uh, research space and the way we share resources and infrastructures, I think that is actually unique anywhere in the world. I think I'm most proud of the, uh, the quality of the faculty that have been recruited and the culture um, within the faculty of seeing, of merging teaching and research as part of what they do every day and interweaving that together. Yeah, I'm proud of the, the, the quality of students that we get in and what they're like when they leave. So here was a university and a community that came together. We've built something, we've delivered a program. So it's, to me, it's much more about globally celebrating the accomplishment and looking forward to what we can do in the future.